Remember I said I had another uh, bag of candy? This is it. I was going to post it last night, but I fell asleep. So, this bag contains Snickers, Twix, and M&M's. Fun size. I don't know if you can see that. Let me pull out the bag for you. Fun size. Also, check that out. Yeah? You like that? Two and four. I could be the only one that thinks this. A lot of times I am the only one that sees things the way I do. But seeing this makes me think that you're going to give this whole bag to somebody. And I don't know. That's just kind of weird. I guess it's not that weird. I, I have given a girl a whole bag of candy before. But that was different. That was to cheer her up. That wasn't the Valentine's thing. All right. Here we go. Got my knife. Even if I screw this up and I don't like the way it turns out, I'm going to post this video anyway because, you know, I robbed you all of the opportunity of seeing me rip open the other bag. So what do we got? Now, of course, the last bag of candy was from Hershey's. This is Mars. So, I'm a little bit curious because, as you can see on the packaging, Twix is in a gold heart and M&M's is in a red heart. But up in the corner, it says milk chocolate. But the red packaging usually denotes the peanut butter M&M's. So, and I have no idea what these purple Snickers are. I actually don't like Snickers at all because I don't like peanuts. I don't like peanuts in their natural form, but I do like them in butter form. And that's about it. Okay. M&M's in pink bags instead of red bags. Still being kind of deceptive. So, Twix and red packaging. I see this. I think peanut butter Twix, because those are amazing. But, I don't know. It's got this gold strip right here. It might be regular Twix. It also says, let's mix it up. Which tells me, yeah, let's mix this up. Let's put this in a peanut butter package, but let's make it the regular Twix. And if that's the case, I hate you, Mars. We have one, two red Snickers, and... Four, six, seven, eight purple Snickers. As I said before, I don't like peanuts. And I... I don't know. I don't know if I should try one of these for y'all or not. That was kind of nasty. And dorky. Let's see what's inside. Oh, that's not delicious. So it's the chocolate shell. And it's got peanuts. So, gross. I'm just going to throw that away. Put it over here. So the pink M&M's. Apparently the red M&M now has a mustache. Or is that... It is a mustache. A mustache, and he eats roses. <sighs> fun size. Did the Snickers also say fun size? It does say fun size. Fun size. I, I'm not having a lot of fun here. That's uh, false advertisement. Oh, what? <laughs> not even the traditional ones. We got red, pink... White, they have silver M's. They don't taste like love. They don't taste like fun either. This one just has a Roman numeral three on it. What's up with that? Anyway, let me eat the rest of these. All right, 
Should I open one of these red stickers? I already did that. The purple stickers in. Should I open one of these? Probably with this the same. Allergy information. Contains peanuts, milk, egg, and soy. May contain almonds. That's kind of weird, isn't it? May contain almonds. Like, what do they sneak in sometimes? Undercover? Incognito? Like, oh yeah, I'm a peanut. Yeah, I'm totally a peanut. Alright. More confusion. Gold packaging. Red packaging. Alright. Well, here it says cookie bars. Can you see that? It's kind of blurry. There it is. Sort of. Just trust it. <clears throat> and this one says cookie bars, also. Yep. Not peanut butter. I like these anyway. I just record the peanut butter. Well. I'm disappointed by the packaging. Yet again. But at least they're consistent. Both Mars and Hershey's. In their practices. Well, that's about all for this uh, unboxing. So, thanks for watching. And... Yeah. Bye.